Hi there, we're going to take a look at track stacks in this video. Track stacks can be a method used to organize a series of tracks or even start creating a submix. But in this video, we're going to take a look at how we can use MIDI with track stacks for some really cool synth stacking. So I've got three different synth sounds here, and what I'm intending to create is really nice stacked lead synth that's got loads of body, loads of top end, loads of width, and it's just going to cut through the mix. And usually in order to do that, you might have to use two or three different synth patches and stack them up playing the same riff. So I've got three different synth sounds here. I've got a Silymph Super Saw that I created. So I used some uh, sawtooth waves and I've detuned them. And it's created a nice wide sound. I've added a bit of reverb as well. And I've got a synth on Massive, and it's quite simple again. It's just a, some sawtooths, uh, pitch down, a couple of octaves. And it's more my bass tone synth, my low end really, it's providing a body. And then I've got the Alchemy as well. And uh, I just used one of the presets for this, the Mellow Chimes preset. Bit of a dreamy sound with lots of top end and a bit of vibrato on there. So I've got this little hook here. That, that this top one is the silent here, this top instrument. The usual way to go about things would be to copy this region to my massive synth. to create this stacked patch and then copy it over to the alchemy as well. Which is easy enough to do, but what happens then if I wanna say, change some notes in one of the riffs and go, I don't know, let's move this up by five semitones. I would then need to delete all of these and copy this over and it can get a bit long winded constantly doing that. So what you can do with Logic is use track stacks in order to create a stat synth and you can actually save that out as a patch. So you can delete those two regions here. And what we can do, highlight these three tracks, right click on any one of them and select create track stack from these three tracks. And we want a summon stack and create this summon stack. And what we can do now is if I move this MIDI region to the top so it's on the summing stack, it's on this summing track here. This acts as a master for the other three instrument tracks, the three instrument tracks contained within the stack. And we'll play this MIDI riff on all three. And what's awesome as well is, you know, if I have this sum highlighted here, if I have the silent, just so gonna play the silent or massive or alchemy. If I have this sum highlighted, play some notes on my keyboard, it triggers all three synths. So then you could just start recording some different stuff in. You know, or just audition some sounds on this stacked patch here. And say if we wanted to save this patch out but we wanted to maybe do some other stuff to it so say the silent here I'm going to take the reverb off say so if we want a reverb in, in, included in this patch what I'm going to do here is create a bus send for this silent send some of this bus send amount in here to this bus to create a reverb on here space designer and take the bus up a bit. So we've got a reverb on there. And now this aux 2 is our reverb. Go into our mixer, go options, create track for selected channel strip. And what it's done here is, is added this, it's created a track in our main window for this reverb and we rename this. And it's also added it to the track stack. We could maybe put it at the bottom or it's added it here because Silent has been sent to it. So 
but we can move it to wherever we want. As long as it stays within the track stack, see if I move it to the bottom now, it's not got this little line on there anymore, so it's no longer in the track stack. So make sure it's in there somewhere. So we've got the reverb on the silent. We've got the free synth stacked up there. What we can do now is with this someone highlighted, go to our library, go to save, and we can save all of that as a patch. So I'm going to save it as sum2. And so now that's all saved as a patch. So say if you come to, let's just load up a new project now, close this. You come to be working on a project at another time and you're like, yeah, I really like that stack that I created. You can actually just load it up super quick here, sum2. I loaded it up there and then we have our sum2, open it up. It's got our silent with the reverb send, massive, and the alchemy. So we've actually created and saved out a patch, which is a combination of three different synths and is a super stacked synth that we can just bring into any project at any time. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that video. Any questions, give us a shout. And thanks for watching.